Greetings, YouTubians. Quick little channel update. I've bought a few things in the last couple weeks, both for Roxy and for Rita. I've had the cover for Rita. I need to get a half cover for trips and my daily commute. I've got a full cover and half cover for Roxy. Half cover's over here, still in its packaging. I'll be taking that out and figuring out a better way to pack it to be able to put it into my tail bag. That's the other piece. I got tail bag and two tank bags. Tail bag and tank bag for Roxy and tank bag for Rita. Just makes it easier for me to commute on Rita. I can put all my small essential stuff in that bag and that can go in with me and get locked up in my locker while I'm at work. It'll also help out for on trips. I can keep everything that I need close at hand for quick changes, batteries, charging cables, chargers, cell phone can go in there when it's raining so it's not exposed to weather. Same thing on Roxy. Tail bag I got so that I can put my lunch bag and a few other things in for my commute to and from work. And this will come in handy if I do take Roxy on trips and I don't trailer her. I plan on trailering to almost every meetup just because if anything happens while I'm on my trip, I'm screwed. I can't go nowhere. I can't even make it to the meetup if the bike breaks down on the way. This will help for meetups that are close by. I'll be taking that. I got the pit bull lifts for Roxy just for ease of maintenance in the driveway. Got all my stuff for chain maintenance, the brush, the cleaning solution, and the chain lube. I also had a GPS mount for the GPS that came with Rita put onto Roxy so that I'm, that'll make it easier for my commute because I didn't want to put a, an X mount like I've got on Rita just for my cell phone, just in case it's raining. This thing is water is weatherproof, so it'll be fine if it gets rained on. Not so much my cell phone. I have been considering turn signals built into the side view mirrors for Roxy. I'm getting cut off quite often on this because I don't have the same visibility and it's only the one headlight is on when you're running. The turn signals only turn on when you're signaling a lane change or turning. What I was considering doing was going with turn signals in the side mirrors and then getting running lights to replace where the current turn signals are. That way I would have the added visibility. I'm considering getting a double bubble windshield just because I'm getting a lot of buffeting. And the reviews that I've seen for the double bubbles have been really good. Comment if you guys has the double bubble and what your opinion is between the stock windshield and the double bubble. I'd really like to hear your opinions on it. The tail bag connects, there's a strap that goes under the rear that holds it, keeps it from flying off that way obviously. And then the straps on the front attached to the foot pegs. Mrs. RT is only going to be wanting to ride on the back of Rita because it's the more comfortable ride so I figured I wasn't about to spend the extra 300 some dollars for the hard plastic cover on the tail. If I had gone that route with the hard cover I wouldn't be able to put the tail bag on. Well guys this has been my quick little update for you. Hope you liked it. Until next time enjoy the ride.